uh, getting all hyped up to see the Phillies take on the Braves tonight. Caroline Goggin live with some of the tailgaters. What's it like right now there, Caroline? Oh, Brian, the excitement is so high here outside Citizens Bank Park this afternoon. The tailgating lot, they opened, it, opened up about an hour ago at 3 o'clock. We want to show you this crew right here. <laughs> They are from Bristol. You can see some of them. They are sporting those Phillies overalls that are in very high demand right now. And with four hours before first pitch, there are people here ready for bedlam at the bank. Hopes are high in South Philadelphia, ahead of a huge game four for the Phillies. I'm confident we're going all the way. Fans are especially confident after a big win over the Braves in game three. Many agree the star of that game was Bryce Harper. The emotion he played with and you know, you kind of feed off of that. There was a lot of emotion after Braves shortstop Orlando Arcia joked attaboy Harper in front of reporters following the Phil's loss in game two. Last night, as Harper ran the bases after his two homers, he stared Arcia down. I think that's going to go down as the coldest moment in Philly sports history. Local shirt company Philly Goat is now capitalizing on the drama with these t-shirts. They've sold about 500 since last night. We just, you know, got to work and we churned out, you know, a shirt design and you know just quick to market um, as soon as the game ended we dropped that shirt it could be something to wear tonight if you're lucky enough to have tickets to the game there's nothing like it. it's electric we got great a great squad of players that everybody can see and it's like I could have them over all over my house for Sunday gravy for lifelong Philadelphia sports fan Jacob Long this postseason run is emotional it's all about family he has stage four cancer and says he would love nothing more than to watch the Phillies in the World Series with his grandson. I've seen 1980, I've seen 2008, I've seen when they lost in the 83, when they lost in uh, what, 2019, uh, 2009, last year. So hopefully they win this year so I get to see another one. This is much more than a game to some people. So Phil's got to go out there, win this one for Mr. Long, win it for all of the fans here. It is going to be electric inside Citizens Bank Park tonight. If you don't have tickets right now, the cheapest ones I found on StubHub were about $440. Seems high, but good news, Brian and Sarah, it's actually about $20 less than what they were a couple hours ago. So maybe if you want to cash in, you could get your ticket before tonight's game. That's the latest live outside Citizens Bank Park. I'm Caroline Goggin, Channel 6 Action News. Go Phil's. Back to you guys. That's it. Go Phil's. Caroline, thank you. <laughs>